Stops. He knows how to navigate the zone, but one of the things against Pitt in that blowout loss. Walker right. feeling it. Syracuse coming away with the turnover. Brooks in a quick entry into this game. Gerard with a nifty fake and knocks it down. Now Syracuse on a mini 6 nothing run, but they desperately needed that. Richmond kicks it here for Griffin. Yes, 14 to 12. Yeah, they had that 12 run. Blake and McGusty checking back and playing in this game as well as Dane Gack, who's in the game now. Gets in the corner, unable to knock it down. And now Miami is 0 for 8 behind lead for the Orange. Shot clock of factor down to 2, a collision. Solid since the opening minutes. Here's Gerard side, that won't drop, but controlled by Syracuse on the baseline and a stuff by Gurrier. Success. Gurrier to the paint off the fake. Boy, is that a pretty play, hasn't he in particular? He really has, and right there, you know, when you get the basketball inside, it's about to go into the game, fortunately, for Allen Griffin. Elijah dumps it off, and an easy two for Griffin. And that gets you going to knock down a couple of threes, but Syracuse is only give five to 22. Cross back into the game. Here's Wong again, and yes, he swishes in. You and I, hum and strum. And yeah, my nice guy, give underneath. Is D.O.B. Coming in, playing the point guard, pushing Gerard off the basketball, and normally a scenario for the Orange. Gusty little floor gets whacked <laughs> on the head or gets absolutely plowed into the ground. Little pull up pop, knocks that one down. And the early portion of the first half, Wong inside and ever since. And they, the beautiful weather in Miami, 77 tomorrow. Nice look there for the stuff by Gurrier. What they're doing. You are too. You watch a ton of basketball. You watch as much as anybody. <laughs> With the national championship and multiple Final Fours. Syracuse wins this one big time.